all you wine lovers out there, I'm Amanda Vanderpool here with Maximo TV in beautiful Malibu, California for the 10th annual Harvest and Crush event. Let's go talk to a few of the celebs that support this cause. Yeah, I just wanted to be here because I think it's so important for kids to have places that they can go to you know, keep them out of trouble, keep them off the streets. And I think especially in an area like LA, there's so many talented kids here. It's really great that they're giving them an opportunity to sort of channel all of that. So. Yeah, I'm really excited about it. I'm um, working for Fox 5 San Diego News, and I'm a correspondent on the news. You can actually, nice. everyone nationally can watch it online. It's really fun, so um, but it's a steep learning curve. It's really hard because you, I had no idea like how difficult live TV being a, a correspondent is. It's much easier when you're being interviewed. Being the interviewer, as I'm sure you know, is a lot more difficult, So, but it's really great, and the people there are wonderful. Are you going to partake in the crushing of the grapes? Um, I'm guessing from the empty glass that needs to be filled, I've got to crush some grapes before I can fill it, so I guess that's that's part of the whole thing. So tell us about the show on Sci-Fi that you're working on. Yeah, I'm uh, recurring on a show called Warehouse 13, and I just went to a, a party at the showrunner's house last night, and the finale is fantastic. Really? It's really, really exciting. Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy. Um, I did a show called Relic Hunter a few years back, and, and this, this show is like, you know, in the same realm, but like, way, way better. Really? <laughs> and I'm so happy to be a part of it. It's, it's fantastic. What is your favorite wine to drink? Uh, I like a big, bold Bordeaux, so I'm hoping that they'll, they'll uh, have one here for me. <laughs> I'm always interested in the arts, and I'm also interested in children's children education. And uh, it's very well known that children do well studying arts, art programs, and creativity. And I know that it's something that disadvantaged children don't have the opportunity for. And it's very important. So I'm out here to let everyone know the importance to support the arts and education in all demographic groups, because it helps children be smarter and do better in college, do better in life, and do better in love. Focus on yourself. Focus on your career. Um, boys will come and go. Friends stay forever. So. Um, I'm just saying, you know what? Um, love isn't everything. I know it's important. I'm, I'm in love with love, but I, I'm also in love with my career and I'm in love with myself and I want to see myself succeed because I do want a family one day. That is every girl's dream. So I want to do it the right way. So just think about your future. Get good grades because I promise you it helps. I didn't think it did, but now I'm 22 and I'm like, oh gosh, if I only paid a little more attention in school, you know? So just just listen to what your parents say. They're only there for your best interest, I promise. Are you a wine connoisseur? I am. I like white wine. I like the sweet kind, the ones that taste like candy. Like right now, I love Moscato because it tastes like white grape juice. Yeah. What are you eating right now? We're eating ice cream. Yes. <laughs> Hers is pretty boring. Yeah, you know, I don't, I'm not a big whipped cream fan, so I just like the plain. But yeah, I put um, got vanilla bean, chocolate syrup, whipped cream, M&M's. I had a brownie in there. It was a little like chocolate thing going on in there. It's really good. So you built your Sunday yourself? Oh yeah, oh, of course. All right, Boo, so you're gonna be in the upcoming Breaking Dawn. As you guys know, it's gonna be split up into two films, so that's really great. Uh, we should go in production uh, around November, and we're just really all excited to be a part of it. I'm excited to see how they do uh, Renesme the baby, because if you've read the books, like she's a baby, but she has qualities of like an, an adult or teenager, and um, I think it's just going to be really great. We're doing a new ch show on the um, new network called The Hub. We can't say much about it, but we can say that it's not a reality show. It is scripted, and um, yeah, we'll be starting very soon. Mm -hmm. So hopefully that turns out really good. We've been doing a lot of music lately, working on the album, and yeah.
Thank you for watching. Now it's time to stomp some grapes. Woo! <laughs>